oh man, this video is going to make a lot of people mad, but I feel I need to tell you the truth. Are you seeking out affirmations to help you win the lottery? If so, here's my best advice. Stop it. There are far better ways to attract and bring money into your life, and I will share some of those in this video. But let's just set the record straight here. Sure, playing the lottery every now and then for fun, great idea. I've done it, and even though it's very rare, I've won a couple bucks. But is it really the best way to attract money into your life? I mean, I believe in the power of affirmations and manifestation and law of attraction and all that good stuff, but can you saying affirmations about getting the winning numbers, can that actually manipulate how the numbers come up? I'm not sure. You probably got hundreds or thousands of other people doing the exact same thing. So is everybody going to win the lottery at the same time? I don't know. I've never relied on things like that to support myself. I'm encouraging you to reconsider. And I understand while you're most likely wanting to win the lottery, you're probably struggling financially. And it seems like one way to bring a lot of cash into your life. I can relate because I have been there in a number of times in my life, particularly years ago. But I've been living pretty abundantly in recent decades and it wasn't because I won the lottery or had some great stroke of luck. So if you're needing an influx of cash into your life, here are some simple things that you can do to bring money in, maybe in the next 24 hours, 48 hours, I don't know. One, do you have anything to sell? Do you have anything that you own that's still usable, that might be of value to someone else that you no longer use? Put it up on Facebook Marketplace or on Craigslist. Is that still even a thing? I think it is. Spread the word amongst your friends. Hey, I've got this thing, this lawnmower, this whatever power tool that I no longer use. Who would like to buy it from me? That could be a way of bringing in cash. You probably have things in your house or right under your nose or in your car right now that you could potentially sell to someone to bring in a little bit of money. Beyond that, do you have a skill or a talent that someone would be willing to pay for? It could be as simple as shoveling snow or mowing lawns. Maybe you paint walls or maybe you you're good with carpentry and woodworking. Certainly, if you know your way around a computer, there are a lot of people that could use your help and would be willing to pay you for that. I'm sure you've thought of these things before, but that's really where riches come from. And I think the key to making this work is realizing that your talents are a solution for a problem that someone else is having. Think in those terms. What's a problem that you can solve, that you are uniquely qualified because of your experiences, things you've done in the past, that you can solve that problem for that person? The bigger the problem, the more they'll be willing to pay you. So what is that thing that you can offer? Are there things that you can make and sell for money? That could be food, could be artwork, jewelry, sculpture. Can you make music boxes or gift baskets? I mean, the list is endless. What have you made in the past that you could offer for money? Here's the bottom line. If you're going to be putting your time and energy into affirmations, instead of hoping and wishing that you win the lottery, affirm that money is flowing into your life, that you're going to find and recognize a way to earn money through these things that I just talked about. See it happening in your mind's eye. Believe that it can happen. Know that you have the ability to create these opportunities. It's an exchange of value. You have something of value to offer someone else, whether that's a thing you're selling, a service, a product, whatever it is. And people are more than willing to pay you for that thing, for the convenience, for the luxury of having you provide it to them. That's where you should be investing your energy. If you got a couple extra bucks, go ahead. Play the lottery, but don't put all your eggs in that basket, so to speak. You are worthy and capable of so much more, and I want you to succeed. So stop investing so much time in lottery affirmations and invest that time in yourself. I hope this helps.